Okay. What's going on, YouTube? We're back. So, this thing, this little episode, is going to be a little, like a pseudo episode zero, because we're restarting uh, the little playthrough, unfortunately, because saves got corrupted, and we, I figured, just instead of starting 10 hours, uh, like a, a, a save from 10 hours previous to the one we were at, I figured just, just do this. So, what, uh, yeah, so that's what we're doing today. Uh, before we get started, though, subscribe, you know, 46% of you, not subscribe, fucking do it, all right? Like the video if you like the video, and comment, share, all that stuff, check out the Discord, check out my Twitter, Twitch page, or Twitch stream, we do this Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m., check out the Patreon if you want to support, if not, it's fine, again, it's 100% optional, you get, um... By doing, if you do choose to, you get access to some chats in the Discord. You get uh, access, uh, depending on which tier you do, you get access to early work in progress versions of my mod. Uh, right now, the one I'm working on is Gunpowder Crafting. Um, the I just uploaded a new one this Sunday uh, that covers basically all vanilla ammo types that will allow you to craft them at the chem bench. Um, Starting the uh, in the next update, so point two or whatever I'm on, I forgot. <laughs> I think point three. Um, I'm going to implement complex caliber, and I'll have a few of those bullets covered and balanced. Um, and yeah, and maybe I'll do. I'll add them to the ammo crafting bench. I, I think it's added by Armor Smith or Armor Keyword. I don't remember, uh, but I will. Add that, uh, and what else? Um, I think that's it. So yeah, so let's get into it. So, yeah. So episode zero, basically what you want to do, if you're starting a new game or new character, never start with all your mods loaded. That's pointless. There's no reason to do so. You should start with like script mod, not script mods, but like, not either um you want to start with like your ui mods your your core gameplay mods and your uh your looks menu and all that stuff ba basically make a judgment call like do you really need it at the beginning of like as soon as you load your game you know if not then you don't yeah, i don't really need that either at the beginning textures Uh, so like settlement mods, patches, like literally like unofficial patch you probably want. Um if you have a pit boy replacer, you probably want that. Five face hair files, sell so like I said, settlement. Um yeah, anything core to the game. Like any so like I have what BLD, Agony, and um Damn Apocalypse, you want all those, probably. If you have all those, you want those loaded. Those are, like, core gameplay mods that you probably want loaded from the start of your game. And, yeah. So. Yeah, so, like I said, this episode's gonna be a little... It's It, it could be shorter. I don't, I don't know. We'll see how long it goes. But, um... It's just gonna be me setting up the new character. So, yeah. Just so you see how I do things when I uh when I start a new save because I don't think I did this in the first actual episode of on YouTube, so I figured it'd be a good idea to show people how to start a new game or like to start a new save properly. New game. That's right. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. that intro and about a bajillion times all 
War, War never, never changes. changes. You're going to knock him dead, dead the veterans hall tonight, huh? You, you think? think? Absolutely. Absolutely. Now get, get ready and stop, stop hogging in the mirror. mirror. Right. <laughs> I've only seen this about four billion times. Hey, my turn, big guy. Just sit here a minute, let everything in the top left, as you see, load. Uh, or like, you know. I just like to make sure, like, I know, like, it all loads at the same time, but like, and it's only stuck at like, um, like how fast, or how many, like, the two lines at a time. I just like to let it, like, go through and everything before I proceed, just to make sure everything's all loaded up. Okay, that uh, was faster than I thought. I got this, uh, did a little stretch. But, uh, yeah, alright, so yeah. Oh, yeah, another thing. If you're using Be Exceptional at the start of a game and start me up, you want to disable Be Exceptional. You don't want it enabled. Right? My dog's barking, so it's going to be hard to talk because I feel like you're going to hear it. Basically, what you want to do is have it disabled initially when you, you know, create your character and all that bullshit. And then once you get into game, make a save, like a uh, save wherever you start your game off. And then you want to go back, enable all your mods that you, uh, you know, and then, uh, and then go from there. So, yeah. Three. Five. And four. Oh, wait, hold on. Drink that. There we go. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Do that. I like to start in the basement shelter because it's an interior cell. It's in the general starting area of the game, and it also it, it loads pretty quickly because again, it's interior and it's a very tiny cell. So you, you know, if you want to start anywhere else, it's fine. You know, I just prefer to start there. At least when I'm making the game, I could just teleport somewhere else if I really, really want to. No, level five. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Why is it over there? I guess I'm moving the XP counter back to the center. God damn it. That's so dumb. Oh, I hate that that's tied to that. Oh, come on. All right, whatever. So, yeah, let's just let everything in the top left roll on the XP counter. And the XP counter. All right, so basically, I think I have survival options. You want to make a save here just in case anything bad happens. You crash, whatever, and literally anything. You mess something up, you have to undo it. Uh, what was my save key? It was like, not F11. N? Okay. Nope. Nope. F8? F8. There you go. That's it. Save. Okay. Quit. Desktop. Switch to the full version of your game with everything loaded or whatever you want loaded. Uh, um... 
everything. Yep. Okay. Start at four S E. So yeah, basically, uh, like I said, you want to start with just a minimal load so that you can load into the game really quickly and just get the core stuff in. After that, you're going to want to load everything else so that you can finish or you can do all the settings and everything else can load in properly with it. Or can be added to the save. And it's I'll start with a Glock, so a little cheap version. Okay. Bully Trader, level 5, yep. Yes. Yes. Mark 18. Skip quest. Skip quest. Skip quest. Yep, yep. Bully. Yes, 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 yes. Yep. 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 Everything else? Yeah, everything's adding to the level list. I like to wait for everything in the top left to go through before we do anything else. And once that's all done, I'll do another save just to make sure everything's all uh, done, or like when it's done, done. Okay, I think that's the last thing, usually. Yes, sir, and I need a couple. Oh, no, BLD, okay. And everything, okay. Yeah, save. Do my. That. Okay. All right. Next thing, go again, save again. Just like to, you know, no, that's done. Uh, the, yes, these are not, okay, so this is hunting rifle. So yeah, this is one of the issues with the weapon replacers. Sometimes it doesn't, actually, wait, hold on, if I do that, I think it should. Yeah, change it back, okay, good. Um, yeah, sometimes you get a little fuck ups. I love this Glock, man. Uh, yes, uh, obviously, mention, <laughs> obviously, okay, so this is one of the problems with the weapon replacer. Sometimes if you load into the game without the weapon replacers enabled, it, it guns break and look like that. Unfortunate, but, you know, whatever. It's an unfortunate side effect of making your game a little more modern or a little more Tarkov, you know? 
Oh, that's called MPX now. Uh, but yeah. Uh, obviously these are Invis G patch. If you saw the last episode, we did a weapon merge. Uh, and I took I I remade my Viz or the lost Viz G patch merge I had. Uh, so none of the weapons in that are are patched anymore. I have to do that manually now, which is fine. Again, I'd rather do it manually and save like. 10 plus slots on my weapons uh and then not do it you know so like i said it, you know it is what it is um okay so yeah let's get to doing the settings or the mod config fun part all right so ammo ui you do not need that i just want the only reason i have this is for the night vision animation Ingestibles in combat. Wait, it's covered. Set that to. Eh, we'll set that some other. Eh. Anyway, we'll, we'll. I'll think of it. Okay. Uh, these. Yep. All tough strength. Max air trap break. Uh, these can stay the same. Um, widget. I never, honestly, I've had bleeds. I never see the widget. I don't understand why. Power, you know, crafting highlight fix. That's done. Profile, we don't need custom camera. Uh, oh, wait, actually, custom camera, feet, swap shoulders, dynamic helmet, combat suite, yep, cough. Do, do like 40% for all of these things. Agony animation fix. Nope, we have another one's animation fix thing. I think this all stays the same. Yeah, it's this transfers between saves and all that. Same thing with this, I think. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Workbench. Yep. Yep. Global HUD color or configuration menu. Uh, I don't like getting experience from cooking and all that stuff. Disarming stuff. Lock picking can all just be five. I don't like getting, like, you know, leveling up too quick in the game. Workbench, none. Again, that's another shop. Again, none. DLC, robot encounters, off. Sentry bot, spawn. Hundred robot encounter chance out hero. I can get him out. Right, not, I don't feel like dealing. With it. Uh, okay. Hollow time. Set that key. Seven. Here. Right there should be. Uh. But right here. There we go. Okay. Firm. Okay. Uh. No bar, we don't need that. Oh wait, where are we? Hollow time. Hunter. Uh animal options off. Dismemberment on butchering uh, butchering you. Yeah. Test tubes. Uh me. Fade to black off. Advanced time. Sp 
Inspect weapon. L key. Jump grunt. Back attack. I usually leave that alone. This. Load from any. Okay. Quick trade. Uh, hunger options here. Yeah, I like to get rid or disable the um debuffs for like the level one shit, like tired, arched, peckish. It's like I don't don't make me eat like a whole thing of food just so I don't have like minus one agility for like being like oh I'm a little hungry. It's like come on, come on, you know it's just, it's annoying. Combat, yeah, I can say the same. Tactical tablet, it all stays the same. Transfer settlement, stays the same. I don't use the gun, so stay the same. Workshop framework, uh, oh no, workshop plus. Fly, no, nope. Uh, clear weather, we'll do that one. And prevent fall. Actually, those. Yeah, screw if we're building if we're building we're yeah. okay night vision normal vision okay. uh i want this n that rival stat widget i think this yeah they go in place okay that's everything all right so that's basically the start of my game or how like how you you know should start a save ideally you know um yeah like i said it was only, this, this recording was only like 20 minutes you know uh i kind of want to consolidate these things you know it's like i'm doing a little tutorial thing or whatever ideally oh yeah forget that um keep it you know simple it minimal or you know short amount of time so yeah so that's it um if you like the video like the video subscribe comment join the discord follow me on twitter nexus twitch uh instagram i forget i had that um yeah and uh that's about it. The next episode we're gonna have, we're gonna start playing this character, you know. Uh, and yeah, follow there. Um, I think is there anything else I need to say? I do. Oh, yeah, plug the Patreon. Patreon. Uh, if you're interested, you can check it out. Uh, if not, that's fine. Again, it's 100 percent optional. You no. Know? And uh. But if you do choose to, it's a, I, uh, I appreciate it hundred percent. And yeah, I think that's it. So I hope everyone has, oh, wait, hold on. Everyone has, oh, damn it. <laughs> I hope everyone has a good day and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, wait, actually, wait, let me say, yeah, Twitch thing. Um, we, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. Stream, uh, Ball for on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and sometimes I throw Apex in the mix or whatever game I'm really infatuated with at the time. I like to, you know, just so I I don't like burn myself out and fall out. I like to throw in. I'm, I'm limiting myself to like three days a week of of streaming this and working on it, just so you know. Again, so I can do this for as long as possible. Don't want to like you know be burnt out after like a month. So, yeah. Uh, that's it. So have a good rest of your day and see you in the next one.